As a designer, you have the passion in the blood. That is always something that roots you to the ground, is that you have this creative need to, to try new things and, and push the boundaries. So I was actually born in Coventry, which is the car capital of the UK. And my next door neighbour was a lecturer at uh, Coventry University. And I said, I'm interested in art, I love cars and solving problems. He said, come along then to see the transport design course. So uh, I went along and I saw these students sketching on a table and I thought, wow, that's cool. That's what I want to do. And he actually said to me, he said, I recommend that you do an engineering apprenticeship and do fine art because that's what design is about. So that's what I did. I think um, something that I brought to, to Volvo was actually um, my approach to design. I challenged them to create a design in just two or three lines uh, to get the character. Um, I asked the designers to keep that sculpture as a reference to the piece of design they started with to make sure that we captured the theme all the way through to the end of the process. And I think that's really played off in the products that we see today. Robin has elevated the uh interior design and quality of Volvo to an absolute benchmark level. He gave it that amazing premium appeal that uh, we see in the cars today. For me, a measure of your achievement is, is seeing your work and referencing back to the original piece. And if it's not changed that much, um, and only for the better, then that's a great piece of achievement. If it's gone completely the wrong direction, then in a sense you fail. When we started this journey of uh, what is our new design language, we also explored the materials and it turned things completely around and the demand for the Scandinavian materials was really well accepted. And it just was that point where we really challenged everything and got that into the marketplace. Mm -hmm.